Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to Red Game Geeks. And today we're playing Pokemon Generations. This, this is amazing. This is very, very early, early on in the alpha. Um, but it is utterly amazing. It truly is. Um, first of all, before we start, I just want to say sorry for not uploading. I did want to upload this video to, uh, earlier on, but it's me laptop broke. I mean, it used to. It's been crashing for about a year, and then one day it crashed, and then wouldn't turn back on. So I had to get sent away, that took a week, and that meant I couldn't upload anything. So I apologise for that, the reason why the other guys haven't uploaded is because they're doofuses, and I don't really have a reason, it's just because they're, they're dicks. Um, so my name is not Pancakes, as much as I wish it to be. My name is, however, Liam. I am a male, um, single player, yes, it starts up. So this is me, this is Liam, running around in a circle here. And it saved my game. Let's disconnect from this <laughs> and click reset. There we go. Stop that. There we go. Now we don't have any Pokemon. Now if I click the tab button, we send out a Pikachu. And definitely the main, the main selling point of this game, which is what I'm about to show you, is definitely the combat. The combat is amazing. Uh, if I can make that smaller, there we go. It was a little bit annoying. Um. It, it's taken something new, well I say new, new to Pokemon and I'm going to show you, so if I click on Pidgey I become a Pikachu and I think this is amazing so I think that's it, Volt Tackle maybe Pikachu also has Thunder Shock, Tail Whip and Thunder Wave and as you, can put, you may be able to see that little yellow bar it's just attack, randomly attack that other Pikachu, that's what I'm going to do that little yellow bar is just sort of the PP. And obviously the green bar and red bar for him is the HP. So yeah, that is the Pidgey fainted. And so what we can do now, if I click tab, bring Pikachu back in. And then click backspace. I can then chuck a Pokeball. If you miss, you just break it. So you have to be pretty accurate with this thing. And I'm really not. There we go. And then it wiggles about for a bit because it's fainted. It is now yours, which is always nice. There we go. So we now have a Pidgey. If I go heal Pidgey up, clicking on this thing, do do do. We get the traditional sort of music, and we'll put Pidgey out in front just so we can test him out. So what I'm going to do in this little video is to sort of show you the other Pokémon and stuff so if I click on Bulbasaur actually we'll send out Pidgey first and now with Pidgey what I like about Pidgey if I click space to jump he glides about a bit so he has whirlwind um, leaves in the way I don't know what this is but it looks like a tackle and I think that's a peck and That's not very nice, but so. And what's what's this? And sand attack. I looks of it. Take that. So whirlwind is quite. Oh, when I say whirlwind, it's probably thrust. It's it's quite a strong move. I mean, if the AI are pretty stupid, like this Bulbasaur is, he will just run into this thrust. And it also protects you from Leech Seed, which is which is always nice. Badass. And I've gotten away with that. Come get me. Come get me. Come get me. More on. <laughs> I don't think I, I don't know if we can attack in the air if it's certainly dead. And if I click space more than once. Take that. But yeah, this is definitely my favourite thing about this game. Come get me. Oh, the Bulbasaur's learned not to run into this. <laughs> and I'm just going to spam this while he spams Lead Seed. Stop that. Thank you. And again, and again. Oh. 
I think not. Oh, this Bulbasaur is proving difficult. There we go. Another cool thing is that you can destroy the rock, so I keep pecking this rock. There we go. The rock is destroyed. I don't know what the benefit for that is, but <laughs> whatever. Alright, uh, so we'll catch this Bulbasaur. How have I got into a place where I could catch him? Here we go. Sweet. So, wrong button. So if we now go in back and to heal the Bulbasaur, and we'll move on. Very nice. First of all, I it down here, but we're going to leave him to a bit later, because I want to show off all the Pokemon, and I want to show off Bulbasaur on Squirrel. There's a Charmander, but we'll come back to that very shortly. Where are you at? There he is. Shook our Bulbasaur into there. And we can battle from up there. Yeah, take that. Right, so. This guy has. What's number one? That tackle. Vine Whip. Growl. And Bleach Seed. I missed. Bleach Seed is quite effective. Like, very, very effective. Especially against this. There we go, see? Now, I'll call you back in. The reason why I've done it from here is because it's see. Don't you dare fall off, because I don't think you can catch him while you're in the water. They didn't let me last time. So, we're just going to chuck Pokeballs from up here. It doesn't help that you move forward ever so slightly. I'm definitely chugging that far too far. There we go, see? Haha. <laughs> I am a ninja. Last time I made this video before I bolstered things up, I didn't catch the squirtle because I couldn't get to him. Uh, so we'll go heal squirtle up and then we'll go take on the Charmander and we'll use the Charmander to fight the right attack. And there we go, and then I've shown you all that is done in this. It's very early on, so. You can't expect too much from them so far. And I don't, and it's still good. We don't need to fight that Pikachu because we have a Pikachu. Um, as you can probably see, let's see if I can make this bigger by not pressing that one. A bit too big. Uh, as you can see, they're all level 1. They do have an XP bar, but that doesn't get filled yet. So that doesn't mean added into a game. Um, and they're all level 1, so we'll make that smaller again. We'll move Squirtle up to the top. I'm definitely excited for to see more of this game. I mean, I've only pl played this much amount of it, because that's all there is, and really I'm enjoying it. It is a really good game, I'm sure man does a dick with that. Right, let's see. He has Tail Whip. Bubble. Tackle and withdraw. Take that. Keep your bubbles good, damn you. Bubble is definitely the sort of move we want in this. Oh, I ran out of PP. I've got no PP left. Damn it. Take that. Ah, oh, he's got clearly got a flame body. Sort of ability. Where you at, fool? Get back here. 
Come run away from me. Get back here. But no PP anymore. That's never good. This is definitely going to make sort of battles more interesting this way, rather than a turn-based. Although turn-based is a good sort of way to fight on this. He keeps them flitting away. Take that. Damn it. But it's definitely going to make it so it's not so much luck where you need. If you don't hit them, then then you're screwed. This is definitely a, a sort of a more skilled sort of Pokemon. I definitely do like that. I think that... Oh, what's it called? Smoke screen. Gets rid of your PP. I wish you'd stop doing it, because it's starting to get a little bit annoying. Come and fight me like a man. There we go. <laughs> Only just. I don't want to bring Squirtle back first. Squirtle definitely took a bait, and Charmander is definitely one little pesky Pokemon. Red. Sweet. There we go. Heal up Charmander, then we'll face the right attack, and then there we go. Do 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 do. Sweet. Here we go. One more Pokemon. I choose you, Charmander. Right, let's see what moves this guy has. Scratch. Ember. Growl. And smoke screen. Really not scrote smoke screen really does, but oh well. I think Growl just sends them back a bit. Yeah, I think Growl I mean smoke screen definitely just gets rid of their PP. Good luck, Charmander. Charmander's gonna die to this right attack. Damn, that's Charmander down. Charmander, you're crap. Right, it's dead right attack. Leave it alone. Pikachu, we'll finish off with you. Jump, Pikachu, jump. Jump! 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 There we go. No match for Pikachu. Um, that's going to be it for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This was a really good game, so I'll put the link in the description. Go download it. It updates every now and again. And it's really, really good. Um, so, definitely go check this out. I'm very excited for this game. I think it's going to be amazing. As long as they keep doing it how they are, I mean, it's very early on, you can't really do anything, you can see them doors right in front of me, you can't go in them yet, unfortunately, it's too much Professor Rogue's lab, uh, but just keep supporting guys, and I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did, please leave a like, and possibly subscribe, and leave a comment saying what you liked and what you didn't, so yeah, that's it guys today, I hope you have a nice day, and I'll see you all later, goodbye.